we will take a look at how you can fix the problem with a blurry camera. Now you can see this blurry camera pictures quite blurry and there are quite a number of reasons why your camera may be blurred. Now the first thing is to check the back the security box. Make sure the cables is not loose. Loose cable can definitely close the cable as you can see here. When I move the cable at the back, the picture start to move. So make sure you unplug and then plug it back in again. So make sure so the cables at the back of the box is nice and secure. Plug it all the way into the security box, DVR box. So no loose end connection. If it's loose, then you will not get a clear pictures. Now you can see after I move the cables around, the picture is now clearer. Now, sometimes it could be the cable is damaged. This cable is damaged or it's too long. If the cable is too long, then over the line, it will lose signals. So make sure that the cables meet the standards specification of the cameras. If it's too long, if you try to connect to a very long cables or an extension cables, then that definitely can cause the problems. Now you can see here, when I move the cables around, the pitches uh, quality changes. So be sure that the cables attached to the box is nice and secure. Another problem with the cameras, you can see here, it's not very clear, it's kind of blurred or not very sharp. That is to check the camera lens. Now other thing that can cause the camera blur is the lens that you can see right here. If the lens is dirty from rain or dust, then it can make the cameras a bit blurred. Sometimes spider webs or insects or bees or fly, they can uh, put stuff on it. So that will cause the lens to get dirty, so you need to clean it. So when you get a nice rag or piece of tissues and then clean the lens. So give it a good clean so you can see this, the lens here is dry and it needs a bit of water to, um, to moisture to clean it. So if it's dirty, you need to uh, clean it up before you can start using it. So clean the lens and make sure the glass is nice and shiny. And that should fix the problem of the blurry image on your camera. Now another thing is make sure the camera is not pointing directly at the sun like this. If the camera is pointing directly at the sun, then uh, you're not going to get a very good image because the, the sun light is too bright. So you might want to choose a different location. So point it to a different location where it still can capture the walkway where you want to capture the secure area. And um, yeah, just move your cameras around. Make sure that you don't point into the glass windows because of the reflections then that will can still give you issues uh, viewing the picture. Now some security camera may also have a sunshade where you can adjust the shade so that it covers uh, the sunlight. So check to see if your camera, camera have that. If they do, then you can change adjust the sun, sunshade so that it can uh, cover the lens. Now if your camera have a very low resolution, then make sure that um, your camera have a support high resolution. For example, on your box or on the camera model, check to see if it's a 2 megapixel or if it is a 3 megapixel camera because the higher the megapixel, the better the resolution. And also go into the controller box or the DVR box uh, settings and then check to see if it's uh, set up to the maximum resolutions. Sometimes you can um, reduce the resolution so that you can uh, save the storage space. However, that will lower the resolution. So if you want to um, change it to the highest uh, resolution, go into the settings and change, bring up the resolution to the highest uh, that the, your camera can support. Now, if you're having a problem seeing the camera pictures at night time, then make sure your camera has a um, night vision support. So some cameras do not have the infrared cut filters. And that means uh, at night time you will not be able to see anything outside and it just go really dark. So when you're getting a camera, make sure it supports day and night visions. If it does not support night visions, then there's no infrared for night time. And therefore you will not be able to see anything at night time. Now another thing that can cause the camera not to display properly on a monitor is the power supply. If the power supply goes faulty and do not deliver a constant power source, then uh, from time to time, you may see the camera have lines running on the monitor or the screens, and that is because of the faulty um, power adapter. 
So make sure that you test your power adapter if you have several uh, cameras at home. You may want to switch the power adapter and test it on the one that is working and to see if um, power adapter is the source of your problems. Now sometimes the software can also cause the camera not to work um, correctly. So you might want to go into the security box or the DVI box and then um, go into settings and download the latest firmware for the camera. Uh, a buggy uh, software or firmware can cause the camera not to function correctly and cause it to uh, slow down, um, lagging or uh, even not displaying a clear picture. So go to the website manufacturer, for example, if you are using a S1 camera, you want to go to that website and then download the latest software for that camera and make sure it is up to date. Uh, any software that is not up to date might be prone to bugs and uh, security issues. So always update your security camera software to the latest version. Another thing that you could do is to um, restart your camera or restart the DVI box. So most of the box, um, you can um, reset the, the camera or you can simply pull out the, the power cables, wait for one minute and then uh, plug it back in. So disconnect the power uh, to the camera, disconnect the power to the DVI box and then wait for a minute and plug it back in. If there is a reset button, then reset the DVI box. If there is a reboot option in the DVI settings menu, make sure that you restart or reboot the system and that also can solve uh, the problem with your camera not displaying a perfect picture. And uh, finally, if uh, you try everything and it doesn't work, maybe you can hit to the, the company's website, um, support forum. Most websites have a support um, page or link somewhere that you can post questions or ask them uh, directly via chat or telephone support and ask them of the issues and see if they can help you fix um, the blurry pictures. Sometimes it could be the, the camera is faulty because it has been exposed to a, uh, the environment, the sun, the weather, uh, the hot weather or the cold or the water, the wind, the rain and that over time that can deteriorate the camera and deteriorate the the picture quality or maybe even the glass has been damaged that uh, really you need to replace the whole actual uh, camera unit itself so give all that a try first and if all else fails then contact the website otherwise you may need to replace the whole unit itself and that's it that's how you can uh, fix your uh, security camera pictures uh, quality problems thank you for watching this video i hope you enjoy it and please subscribe to my channel for more videos